So this question says the graph of a quadratic function has an x intercept or has x intercepts at negative 8 and at 2 and has a y intercept of 6. The equation of the axis of symmetry of the graph is. Okay, well let's just set this thing up here a little bit here. So there's my graph. It's going to go through at negative 8 and at positive 2. And it's got a y-intercept of 6, so it's opening down. So the parabola is going to look, I don't know, something like this. Come up, drop down through there. Okay, I didn't exactly hit the 2, but that's not really all that relevant. Actually, what as it turns out here, the fact that the y-intercept is 6, a little bit of a red herring in this particular problem. It's actually not necessary. What i got to remember here is that the axis of symmetry is going to go right down the center of the parabola here. That center is going to go through the vertex. And what's really important here is it's the axis of symmetry. So the distance from that line to both x-intercepts is going to be the same. In other words, the axis of symmetry is right down the center of the two x-intercepts. Or another way to put that is it's the average of the two x-intercepts. So what I'm going to do here is take negative 8 and add 2, and divide that by 2. I'm going to go back to blue here. So it's going to be negative 6 over 2, or x is equal to negative 3. There's my answer. It's C.